What's up guys, Shahbaz here. So the Samsung's next generation of OLED panels will reach a peak brightness of 2500 nits. The display should be equipped on iPhone 15 Pro Max and the top of the line Android models, but not on Galaxy S24 Ultra. Samsung revealed in 2022 the E6 Super AMOLED OLED display, which features a peak brightness of 2000 nits and is being equipped a premium smartphone such as the iPhone 14 Pro Max and Xiaomi 13 Pro. Now Leaker Corner reveals that the company is working on its next generation of screens, which will have the highest peak brightness of a panel for smartphones, brightest smartphone screen. The Leaker claims that the new generation of South Korean smartphone panels will have a peak brightness of 2500 nits a 25% improvement over the current generation model. This higher brightness should deliver an improvement in playback outdoors and also in the quality of content with HDR. Unfortunately, the leaker did not know when Samsung will launch the new display. But Samsung highlighted that another leaker called Shrimp Apple Pro claimed that this panel should be used on iPhone 15 Pro Max indicating that the screen will be released in the third quarter of 2023. According to Tipster Connor, Samsung Display Next Generation Smartphone OLED panel can reach a peak brightness of a whooping 2500 nits. Reliable Apple Tipster Shrimp Apple Pro said that this new OLED panel could be used in the iPhone 15 Pro Max that will be launched later this year. Like the OLED E6 Super AMOLED, the future South Korean 2500-nit panel is also expected to be equipped on some Android devices later this year. Currently, some devices have the E6 model, with the highlight being the Xiaomi 13 Pro, which will be launched globally on February 26. But according to the latest news, the new panel will not be used on the Galaxy S24 Ultra model. One of the surprises in the launch of the Galaxy S23 Ultra this year is that the module does not have the E6 Super Display, with the module having a peak and brightness of just 1715 nits. With that, this will be one of the first Samsung models not to have the screen with the highest peak brightness among Android devices. Therefore, this is possible to believe that the company will maintain this new strategy with the next Galaxy S24 Ultra, which should receive the same 750 nit panel or the 2000 nit OLED E6 Super AMOLED. That's it for now. For more updates, please subscribe to our channel Science and Knowledge. Until the next video, take care of yourself very well. Peace out.